In space where every component must function flawlessly, even the smallest failure can be catastrophic. That's why maintaining a space station's infrastructure is a relentless challenge. Now China has taken a major leap forward with a groundbreaking pipeline inspection robot tested aboard the Tiangong space station during the Shenzhou-19 mission. This isn't just another space experiment, it's a glimpse into the future of autonomous space station maintenance. How does this robot navigate the station's intricate pipeline systems? And what makes it so special? Let's dive into the details. Space stations are complex, self-sustaining environments where every system must work seamlessly to support human life. Pipelines play a crucial role in this, transporting essential fluids like oxygen, water, and coolant throughout the station. But maintaining these pipelines is one of the most difficult and risky tasks astronauts face. In microgravity, traditional maintenance techniques are impractical. Unlike on Earth, astronauts cannot simply move tools and equipment with precision due to the lack of gravity anchoring them. Even a simple repair requires extensive preparation, safety measures, and human intervention. Every maintenance task is a high-stakes operation because any leak or failure in the system could disrupt life support systems or scientific experiments. Additionally, space station pipelines are not uniform. They vary in diameter, shape, and complexity. Some sections are straight, while others have tight curves or sudden changes in size. These pipelines snake through the station in ways that are hard to access manually. Navigating these structures requires specialized training and, until now, relied on astronauts physically inspecting them, which consumes valuable mission time and exposes them to risks. Furthermore, emergency repairs are even more challenging. If a critical issue arises in an inaccessible section of the pipeline, astronauts must take drastic measures, sometimes requiring spacewalks or extensive reconfigurations to fix the problem. These repairs are not only dangerous, but also costly in terms of resources and time. This is why China's pipeline inspection robot is a game changer. Instead of relying on astronauts for tedious and hazardous inspections, this robot can autonomously travel through the station's pipelines, identifying issues in real time and ensuring smooth operations. Its ability to maneuver through these complex internal structures makes it a significant advancement in space station maintenance technology. China's pipeline inspection robot is far from an ordinary maintenance tool. It's an advanced, bio-inspired autonomous system that combines cutting-edge robotics with nature's engineering principles. Designed to adapt to the unique challenges of space station pipelines, it is the first robot of its kind to be tested in orbit. The core of its design is its biomimetic variable stiffness mechanism, inspired by the tube feet of echinoderms like starfish and sea urchins. This innovative feature allows the robot's legs to contract and extend dynamically, enabling it to grip and move through pipelines of different shapes and sizes without getting stuck. Unlike traditional robotic designs, which rely on rigid structures, this flexibility gives the robot remarkable adaptability, allowing it to navigate tight bends, sudden diameter changes, and complex junctions with ease. The robot operates using a combination of passive and active leg scissor mechanisms, which ensures that it can swiftly adjust to varying pipeline conditions. As it moves, its onboard sensors continuously analyze its position, posture, and movement trajectory, ensuring that it stays on course while preventing excessive force that could damage the pipeline. Another remarkable feature is its intelligent control system, which fine-tunes the pressure applied by its legs against the pipeline walls. This optimization is critical in microgravity, where traditional mobility systems might struggle with grip and stability. The robot's ability to modulate its force dynamically allows it to travel smoothly without losing traction. Additionally, the robot is designed for self-recovery. One of the most challenging aspects of autonomous pipeline navigation is ensuring that the robot doesn't get trapped inside complex systems. To address this, engineers incorporated a passive compliant mechanism enabling the robot to free itself in case of power loss or unexpected obstructions. This feature was successfully demonstrated during the Shenzhou-19 test, proving that the robot can recover and continue operation without astronaut intervention. The robot is also equipped with real-time monitoring systems, allowing ground control to track its position, power consumption, and contact force throughout its mission. This real-time data collection ensures that engineers can refine its performance for future missions. 
With 23 degrees of freedom in its movement, a modular design and the ability to autonomously navigate highly intricate pipeline structures, this robot represents a major leap forward in autonomous space maintenance technology. The successful deployment of this pipeline inspection robot is more than just a technological milestone. It's a game changer for the future of space exploration. Autonomous maintenance solutions like this reduce astronaut workload, improve operational safety and enhance mission efficiency. One of the most immediate benefits of this technology is increasing astronaut productivity. Currently, a significant portion of astronaut time is dedicated to routine maintenance and inspections. By automating these processes, astronauts can focus on higher priority tasks like scientific research, space station improvements, and mission critical operations. This technology also holds immense value for long duration space missions, such as Mars expeditions or lunar bases. In deep space missions, astronauts won't have the luxury of frequent resupply missions or external repair teams. A self-sufficient space station with autonomous maintenance systems ensures that minor issues don't escalate into major failures that could jeopardize a mission. Furthermore, this breakthrough aligns with China's broader ambitions for space infrastructure development, with long-term plans for the Tiangong space station, potential lunar bases, and deep space habitats, China is investing in automation to create sustainable and resilient space environments. The pipeline inspection robot is a critical step in this vision, setting a precedent for the development of other autonomous robotic systems for maintaining spacecraft, habitats, and future space-based industries. This achievement also positions China as a leader in space station automation, challenging other space agencies like NASA, ESA, and Roscosmos to accelerate their own robotic innovation. While NASA has deployed robotic arms and rovers for space missions, fully autonomous in-orbit maintenance robots remain an emerging field. The success of China's robot could inspire new international collaborations and advancements in this domain. Looking ahead, this robot could evolve into a fully autonomous repair system capable of identifying, diagnosing, and fixing issues without human intervention. Future iterations might even incorporate AI-driven decision-making, allowing them to predict potential failures before they happen. Ultimately, this pipeline inspection robot is more than just a maintenance tool. It's a vision of the future. A future where space stations and spacecraft maintain themselves, ensuring that humans can focus on pushing the boundaries of exploration rather than routine upkeep. China's pipeline inspection robot represents a significant advancement in autonomous space maintenance. Successfully tested aboard the Tiangong space station during Shenzhou 19, it demonstrated its ability to navigate complex pipelines without astronaut intervention. Inspired by starfish tube feet, its biomimetic design enables adaptability, smooth movement, and self-recovery. This innovation reduces astronaut workload, improves space station efficiency, and supports long-duration missions. As space exploration evolves, such autonomous systems will be crucial for self-sustaining space habitat. If you enjoyed this video, like, share, and subscribe for more space updates. Visit spaceinews.com for the latest discoveries. See you next time.